It is February 9, 2016. This is the Watchman News. David Fry once again is able to get videos out from the refuge. Uh, and this is one of uh, one of three videos that have came out so far today. This is the first one. And uh, this is Sean and Sandy speaking. Day 13 of our false imprisonment at Camp Finicum, and uh, I just wanted to say hello to everybody and thank you so much for all your prayers and for your support. We we appreciate it tremendously. Thank you a lot. We got word that Clive and Bundy is going to be in Burns on Thursday, and hopefully he'll get tons of support there. And and we also heard that, I mean, if you look at the transcripts of Ammon Bundy, he has never said not, or that we should stand down here. He said, if you look at the transcript, he's actually telling the federal government to leave and the other powers to leave. Um, when we talk to the FBI on the phone, they tell us that they can't drop the charges, that it has to go through a process. Uh, I also know that in Ferguson, just very recently a new judge had said that they are going to, they ordered the withdrawal of all the warrants issued before 2015 and because they wanted to restore confidence in the courts there. So it, I know it's possible. They can do it. And those warrants were for like yeah. battery, assault, um, vandalism, looting, rioting, arson, and gunshots fired. And guess what? None of that happened here. We were peacefully protesting the injustices that were inflicted on the Hammond and uh, exercising our first and our second hey, peace. Second Amendment, exactly. So, yeah. so if, if that's possible and the FBI just keeps lying to us because they want to make us give up, um, you don't give up on what's right. We're right. We got um, the sheriff from Milwaukee, mm -hmm. Wisconsin, uh, yeah. David, David Clark, yep. that's asking for the FBI to stand down. Yes, he's in support of us. He, he's, he's in support of the occupation. He said that he's tired of fighting the federal government, and now is the time to take care of this because they're just getting stronger and worse. So, so we do have good people standing yeah. up. But we need help, so help those people that are standing up. Yep. The more people stand, the more power we have. Power in numbers. We the people means all of us. We can stop this tyrannical government and get them out of our lives. And we can get these charges dropped, we can all go home, we can get the refuge back, and we can start helping the, the Bundys and the Hammonds and get their justice because they've been screwed over as well. That's what it's all been about, is the injustices here. Exactly. And when good people exercise their rights, now they're being persecuted. So remember the saying that evil can only exist if good men do nothing. Well, we're doing something, and women. Yeah. We're doing something, and we need everyone to do something. This is the time to take this country back. We need to bring God back and our Constitution back so that we can live free and prosper. The government hasn't done anything to help us. They brought the economy to the crapper. They're helping Planned Parenthood abort babies in us. That's murder. That's murder. Why do these people want to murder people so bad? So they can have complete control over you. Now, if it's this bad now, what's it going to be in 10 years? Please, help us get this word out and stand strong. Force their hand to back down. It can happen. That's the miracle that's coming through Yah. Thank you. Thank you so much. And there you have it. That's Sean and Sandy Anderson from out at the Malheur Wildlife Refuge, otherwise now known as Camp Finnicum. <laughs> 